got the floor. Are you um, aware or were you aware that the one book two villages out there came to Walnut for free? Like that people could go here for free? Like pretty sure that you might have had more people at your stuff that had to pay if we knew we didn't have to go to Walnut for free. You know, didn't have that opportunity. So maybe some due diligence on, can, you could go hear her for free. The same offer. Oh, I see. Like the same week. It wasn't what, even. What did they charge here? I can't remember. Wasn't it like, what was it to go to the lunch? Remember? Cocktails. 25 maybe? 50. Yeah, they didn't have the lunch this year. Yeah, Please, I, I, there uh, was still a few. Okay, so, okay, all right, right, yes, sir. Um, the studio help also, this is just my little thing. I love the studio, hang out in there all the time. You're not paying Jimmy enough. Whatever you're paying him, he needs to make more. Maybe take some of the sidewalk heating money or whatever. <laughs> yes. him. Um, I think that they should want to work there. The people who are in the studio, they should want to be there. They should definitely be comfortable there and they should be competent. And I don't get it. Why somebody that maybe wants to be with children, I, I taught kindergarten. So if I was working at the library, I'd want to be in the children's room. I wouldn't want to be in the studio. You know, like, why can't you have your area of expertise and then have that be your focus area and book that be where you, that's your strength. And then you, that's your thing. Like, don't make them go to the studio and don't make the studio people go to children's. And I don't get your wow. reasoning behind that. So I want to conclude with a reminder. Um, you work for us. Anybody that's getting a salary, so you, um, and you, um, you work for us. Um, any earn, anybody earning, literally, literally, you work for us. And the board, you are elected to represent us. So you need to listen to us. It's our library. 